you're watching UB TV, my name's Jack, and welcome to the final episode in our general election series. All week we've been trying to provide you with an impartial expose on all the candidates from Bristol West and Bristol Northwest. We've covered the Tories, Labour, Lib Dems, Greens, and even UKIP, but now for someone a little bit different. Dawn Parry is running as an independent candidate, which means she's not party affiliated. She wants to represent all the people who are becoming disenfranchised with politics. Now Bristol has elected an independent mayor and independent police crimes commissioner, perhaps Dawn is onto the right track. So let's hear what she has to say. Um, I'm Dawn Parry and I'm standing for Bristol West as a parliamentary candidate. Um, I stand for independence of Bristol, which is not a, a policy driven group, it's a group of individuals who believe that there's no room for party political dogma anymore. And saying that, um, you're running as an independent candidate, does that mean that you don't think that there is a party that represents you, or there isn't a party that represents the UK population? I don't think there's a party that represents any of us anymore, but I feel as though government after government, they make no compromises for us at all. There's always a, an agenda, and there's always that feeling that um, you vote for people, they get into power, and then they kind of somehow conspire to work against you and everything that you believe in. So I feel as though all the promises they make to us, they don't keep. And so I'm standing as an independent for what I believe in and for what I believe the people of Bristol West, and even nationally, want to believe in and, and do believe in. I'm concerned, you see, because I think democracy is kind of, it's lost its way as far as people are concerned. And when you even have people like me who are almost on the verge of being a political anorak, because I just love politics so much, um, feeling disenfranchised and feeling like my vote it doesn't mean anything to anybody because it's the same old thing, you know, the same people get in. You're not going to get a different outcome unless you vote for something different. Vote for something that you believe in or for people that you believe in. And they're going to be more flexible to accommodate for what our country really needs. And party politics is Party politics is definitely not provide. If it did provide that, I think we'd have 100% turnout of people coming out to vote, and people would be really engaged. So what we need to do is get more money out of the businesses, more money out of the very wealthiest of people, and radically alter the whole ethos of the nation being all about profits and, and driving massive conglomerations of, of companies and so on. It's got to be more about people than compassion. So that brings us to the end of our electoral series. If you'd like to find out any more about the candidates we interviewed, we found a really good website was www.yournextmp.com. Now unfortunately we couldn't interview all the candidates, including those from Tusk, Class Wars and Left Unity. However, I can assure you that they were all contacted. But for now, I've been Jack for UBTV. See you next time. Listen carefully.